I didn't get here on my own. Growing up, the statistics said I would fail. It said I would drop out of school and have broken relationships, but I'd never succeed. Throughout high school and college, there were friends, teachers, coaches, and parents that poured into a child that they barely knew, hoping to shape my character and pushing me through doors I never could have opened on my own. After college, I was led to Nashville to a job where I worked for two years. I thought I'd found my career. You've probably heard the saying, when one door closes, another opens. When I lost my job, it felt like a door had been slammed in my face. And again, there was overwhelming support from a loving wife, friends, family, and a church that spent months to help find me the perfect job. I feel I have a purpose, an obligation to serve, and I'm starting a ministry to help others the same way people have helped me. Some people are called to move to the other side of the world to help those in need. I see a broken city right in front of me. A city full of broken homes with children who have no hope of college. Husbands with no hope of finding another job. Families wondering if they'll even have a home next month. This city needs someone to grow with this generation while we equip them with the knowledge and skills to fulfill their purpose and change the world. Someone to piece back together broken dreams and provide connections and resources for those struggling to find a job. Someone to help families have a place to call home when things have never looked darker. Growing up, I said the statistics were against me, but I plan to prove them wrong again and help this generation open doors that they never imagined they could reach. Lipscomb is that door for me. I'm just one degree away. I'm one degree away.